What? She doesn't like boho chic. I'm so taking over this game, it's just not even funny. Oh my gosh, you scared me so much. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, playing with my game. You're channeling your inner status, huh? Yeah, something like that. It's <laughs> fun. Interesting. Oh. Babe, do you want to go to a party tonight? I'm going to show you how to put together some last minute holiday outfit ideas for you and your significant other. These looks were inspired by Style Savvy Trendsetters, which gave me some really great ideas on how to express my personal style and also gave me some fantastic tips for Byron's wardrobe choices too. Whenever it's time to get ready to go to a holiday party or any event really, whether you're going out with your friends or to an event or party, it's really important to know your personal style. Then you can put an outfit together really quickly and you're gonna feel like yourself. This first outfit is sophisticated and girly. Now up top we have this crop navy tweed jacket. It's very girly because it has this little extra pop of detail with the puff sleeves. Underneath the jacket, I have just a basic cotton white t-shirt, keeping you comfortable, but also, you know, dressing it up with the jacket. Then for the pants, I have these kind of, you know, waxy sheen jeans, and I love the color. It's that really oxblood color that's really popular right now. Down below, I have these navy and gold bow peep toe heels. So with the heel, you've got the sophistication, but with the bow, you've got that little added girly aspect. And then with the gold, it's perfect for holidays. I typically am not one to accessorize, but today I wanted to step outside of my comfort zone and I found this great necklace. It's a chain gold necklace and then also the matching chain gold bracelet. So I decided to add these. I think it makes all the difference in the outfit and it really pulls the outfit together. I love this outfit. It definitely represents my personal style, which is girly and sophisticated, so I'm really happy with this look. So today I'm going to be helping my hubby out a little bit because we are on a strict time constraint. So. Up top we have this Henley, you know, t-shirt kind of sweater and it's got three buttons up top, very simple, comfortable. Then we just have a basic dark denim jean. These are something he's had in his wardrobe forever and you can pair with pretty much anything. Down at the very bottom we have his sneakers which we got at a skater shop. These are kind of like a nicer version of a tennis shoe. And those are also navy with kind of like a red. And then you like to cut the lace. Those are more comfortable. Keeps it way. nice and clean, you know, tuck it under the tongue. Just a tip, be sure that your man wears a dark sock to match the shoe. You don't want to be having the fuzzy white gym socks. Keep them dark. We decided to go with this kind of navy and maroon or oxblood colored scarf, which I thought was a really nice masculine looking scarf. We're going to put this on him. We're going to kind of loop it through. Simple, casual, comfortable, but adding something, you know, that's a little different. I like that. Yeah, I think it looks great. I think it feel looks good. Nice. Do you feel comfortable? Yeah. You feel like you can move and everything? feel warm. You feel warm? Yeah. Very good. Okay. Cool. I think you look nice. For this look, I wanted to mix and match textures. So up top, we have this knit sweater, which is kind of a cream beige. You feel really comfortable because you're in a sweater, but it has that added, you know, sheen of silver, which I think is extra fancy. Then down below, I have this pleather skirt. This is great because, again, you're kind of mixing the different textures. Instead of going with a stereotypical tight black tight, I had these zigzag tights, which is what I decided to go with for this. The zigzag kind of just adds a special detail, a little bit outside of my comfort zone, but I think it works. For the shoes, I have these ankle booties. They're a very tall boot. I love these. They're kind of velvet, uh, platform ankle booties, and I think the whole outfit just goes really well together. This, to me, is like the perfect comfortable outfit for a night out. He's gonna do the same as I did, and we're gonna kinda step outside of our comfort zone and mix up textures a little bit today. For up top, we have gray on gray. So we've got the gray sweater over the gray plaid button up, and then we have this fabulous textured tie. I thought that that was so neat. Then, down below, we have the jeans. We have the same shoes as look one, so we've also got the navy kind of dressed up sneaker. So we have this olive pleather jacket, and it Fits makes you perfect. look nice and tough. Nice and manly. Yeah, motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> Olive is super hot this season for both men and women. 
I think that that looks so cool. Yeah, because you're mixing great. the texture of the tie, and then you're mixing the different texture, the pleather, and I just think the colors go really good together. He likes to keep it comfortable, just like me. Mm -hmm. We don't want to show up to a party wearing stuff that we don't feel comfortable in. So how do you feel? Feeling great. I love this. I like it. Very I think it looks really good. Like I said, I'm digging the tie a lot. So for this third and final look, I wanted to take something that I already had in my wardrobe and kind of spruce it up a little bit to be appropriate for a holiday party. It's the basic black dress that you gotta have. And I'm gonna dress this up with a few accessories and a jacket. Up top, I have this cropped faux fur and faux pleather jacket. It looks just like real leather and real fur, but it's a fraction of the cost. And if you're animal friendly, it's great for that too. It's perfect for a nice holiday fancy party. Very comfortable and girly and feminine, so I love that. This is an oversized clutch, and an oversized clutch is really popular right now, A, and B, you're not gonna be carrying that much with you. So it's the perfect size, not too big, not too small. And then, I'm a huge fan of oversized watches. You can dress it down, you can dress it up, you can wear it with jeans and a t-shirt, but you can also pair it with a fancy outfit when you're going to a party. It's a favorite of mine in my wardrobe. Rose gold with a little chocolate plate on top. Down below, I have these patent black heels. They have little jewels on the front and on the back of the heel, perfect for a holiday event. I love this outfit because it's dressy, but it's taking what I already have in my wardrobe, but it's dressing it up for a last minute holiday event. Overall, I think this is the perfect dressed up holiday look. Okay, so for the third and final look for the hubby, we're also doing work with what you have. We have the basic button-up white shirt. We pulled out this vest, and then the girl needs to have the basic black dress. Every man should have the basic black tie in his wardrobe. Paired the three together, which I think makes for a nice dressy look. We're pairing these with the dark denim. And then down below, we have the basic black fancy dress shoes, which again, every guy should have in his wardrobe. That way you can make a look like this really easy for a last minute party. Well, I hope you enjoyed this style guide video. It was fun for us to do. And again, taking pieces that you already have in your wardrobe, getting your own personal style and creating looks perfect for a holiday party. So special thank you to Style Savvy Trendsetters by Nintendo for the inspiration for this video. And I hope you guys have a very happy holiday season. We gotta go. It's Let's time to go to the party. Okay. Gotta go.